I thought this was pretty cool. So uh, let's go for a drive up and down the world's steepest residential street, Baldwin Street in Dunedin, New Zealand. So where is Dunedin? Uh, New Zealand is made up of two islands, north and south. Dunedin is towards the southern end of the South Island. And as we zoom in, you'll see Baldwin Street right there. And we'll go up for a drive in just a minute. But there's more to do in Dunedin than just drive up and down a street. For example, Spate's uh, Beer is on tap all over New Zealand. And you can go and take a tour of their brewery there or have dinner at the Ale House. I had the lamb. It was delicious. You can go to the Olmston House. We checked in on Swarm. I got 14 points. First of my friends. Get a, kind of an upstairs, downstairs, Downton Abbey tour of the place. It was really cool. And found these flowers out back which I'd never seen before, so picture. Then we went and saw sea lions at nearby Sandfly Beach. We didn't just see them, we got chased by sea lions. <laughs> they're much bigger than you think they are, and they're much more agile on the land than you think they'd be. Okay, and then this was one of the coolest things I saw in the entire two weeks we were there. We knew there might be penguins on Sandfly Beach, but we weren't sure if we would see one. And then this little guy popped up out of the surf. A penguin! Okay, but here's what we're doing here. We are driving up and down Baldwin Street. And you can see right there, the asphalt kind of changes. The road surface changes from asphalt to concrete. And according to Wikipedia, that's because the hill is so steep that if they paved it in asphalt on warm days, the asphalt would simply just flow down the street. So they had to do it in concrete so everything would stay in place. That's how steep it is. Lots of people walking all the way up the street. Maybe as a little bit of a challenge to themselves. That's why yours truly walked all the way up the hill. That's me on the left there, kind of lumbering up the side of the hill. I only gained five pounds uh, during our uh, two-week trip in New Zealand. And I have Baldwin Street, I'm sure, in part to thank for the fact because that was some serious cardio. All right, then we're gonna back up. Now, if you go here, I don't know if I'd recommend driving up like we did, because up at the top, it's, it's quite awkward. It's not very easy to turn around. There's a lot of people up there, so you know, maybe take the hike uh, instead of the drive. But we wanted to shoot this video, oh, so we right. drove. Oh, yeah. um, coming up here, look how steep. You can see right there at that little this lift. You can't even see over right it. Yeah. That's how steep it is. Um, see this gray house on the right? That's me with the camera sat on the street level, so the street appears to be level. That's how far I had to lean into the grade. Uh, it's a 35% grade at that point. And then as you continue down, um, you can see how beautiful the surrounding landscape is. The city of Dunedin uh, is incredible, but it's definitely a hilly city. Uh, be prepared to do some hiking. Now coming up here on the, on the right, uh, again, you'll see some hedges with a railing. Uh, and we took a picture earlier of Martin trying to stay level with the, the grade of the street. That's him leaning into it. So that's about halfway down and it's still that steep. So definitely a really steep hill. Um, I guess the reason it's, it's, it is so steep is because the, the city was laid out in a grid by a guy in London who hadn't necessarily seen it. And when they saw the plans, they saw that there was a street there, so they went ahead and put a street there. Now you've got the world's steepest residential street with all kinds of tourists taking pictures. <laughs> so thanks to my friend Pedro Javahiri, who suggested we check out Baldwin Street. He had read about it and looked it up real fast when he found out I was going to New Zealand and showed me pictures. So we made sure to seek it out while we were there, uh, and it was definitely worth it. Very cool, very unique experience. Baldwin Street in Dunedin, New Zealand.